优的兄弟。Welcome back to the channel. I'm feeling a little bit better. Ooh, um, so uh, after not eating last night, <laughs> I'm super hungry. So let's um, see if I can have a breakfast here on board this mirror line on our way to Iceland. I have no idea where I am supposed to go. Captain's Captain's. This ship is so big, I, I don't know how many people fit on board. It's a lot. Oh wow, they even have a team room. Look at this. It's amazing. This breakfast buffet is amazing, amazing. We have so much choice. And well, I couldn't resist the pancakes. Uh, so I got a pancakes with, um, with some bread, egg, and a coffee. So hopefully, <laughs> uh, this food will go down better than uh, yesterday. But uh, yeah, I enjoyed this breakfast. And I also have a sea view, look. Sitting right at the back of the ship here. It's pretty cool. Anyway, breakfast first. Alright, we are now arriving at the Faro Islands. So it's time to uh, get on deck and have a look outside. The weather has cleared up. The captain actually said that the bad weather we had yesterday was unusual for this season. <laughs> that normally it's all smooth sailing. So I was like, yeah, yeah. this uh, you also get this in Iceland let me quickly go there to show you
nicely parked. Don't you think? Woo, we're there on the Faroe Islands. I'm just wearing the mask because there's uh, quite some people now on the deck. And hardly anybody is using a mask. Honestly, I feel like I'm the only one. I'd rather be safe than sorry. Anyway, I don't know so much about the Faroe Islands. I didn't really uh, research it because I'm not getting off here. I think on any normal trip to Iceland, you would make a stop here, do some riding here, and then take the next ferry and continue to Iceland. But yeah, now with all the COVID measures, it didn't really make much sense because, uh, what was it now? You have to quarantine here or something? I can't remember, but when I was looking at it, I was like, it doesn't make any sense to do that. So I just go straight to uh, Iceland. It looks like a proper stunning place. And yeah, what I said before, it's just so hard to grasp that people live here. It is just such a tiny island, completely isolated. Well, most of the excitement is over. So I think people are <laughs> going inside again. But, uh, I'm not sure how long we will stay here, but in any case, I think uh, after those cars get on board, we're gonna leave for Iceland. It will be another night of sailing. So tomorrow at 8.30, we should arrive in Iceland. So I'm pretty excited. Another night on board. Oh. Captain is speaking. So what was I saying? Um, so yeah, tomorrow 8.30, we will arrive in Iceland. The land of ice and fire, and I mostly come for the fire, not so much the ice, of course. Uh, I'm really looking forward to seeing some volcanoes. Uh, have a closer look at all the interesting geology, because Iceland is just such a unique country. And there's a couple of things which are really amazing about Iceland. And the first thing is that Iceland is really close to the Arctic Circle. So actually the northern part of Iceland touches the Arctic Circle. But because you have southern warm water coming and air masses, that touch the northern cold air flows and water masses the climate in Iceland is actually relatively mild so it's not as cold as you would expect based on how northern it is and Iceland is the second largest island of Europe after the UK uh, but because it, it's, it's super close to Greenland so most people don't really count it as Europe anymore but it definitely is Europe but obviously geologically speaking the most interesting thing about Iceland is that it's laying right on the mid-Atlantic ridge and it's the only country in the world which just lies right at this place where the Eurasian continent and the North American continent are drifting apart. So I'm just so super excited to um, yeah, look at all this geology over there. But one more night on board, I really hope that uh, it's going to be a quiet night and not much wind and not much uh, waves because uh, yeah, well yesterday, well you know how that went, it didn't go so well. So I hope that tonight is going to be uh, better. First I'm going to have a closer look at what I see here. Well, those are the houses that I was trying to point out before, but they were a little far away. But um, they have this kind of brass on the rooftops. And, uh, I don't know exactly why they do it, maybe isolation or something. I did read that in Iceland they also have these type of houses. But I didn't know they also had it here. It looks super cool. So earlier I was thinking uh, to fly my drone here, just quickly, like fly it a little bit while the ship is uh, staying here. But uh, I think yeah, it's too risky. If I lose the drone, then uh, that would be such a shame. So uh, I'm not gonna take the risk. It's still quite windy, even though you wouldn't say it now. But uh, you see the flag over there. I don't know if you can see it. I think this is one of those places where it's always windy, so uh, better not uh, risk my drone. Anyway, let's go back inside. So I'm just going to uh, take off my jacket, put it in my uh, room. And then I'm actually going for dinner because it's seven o'clock, I'm hungry. And now the ship is <laughs> nice and steady. So it will be a lot easier to uh, eat. So I'm just gonna do that. It's awesome. It wasn't me. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh wait, oh this is also not my no, this is not my room. Oh, huh? Oh, that is the card I think. No, okay. Coming yeah. out. Because my original card Yeah, it got stuck. It got stuck. Okay. It, it ripped like this inside. Okay. But, but, it, it, but it works now? Um it did, yeah. 
Oh, oh is it maybe stuck? Yes, they did. No, now it's stuck again. Yeah, you can see it. I can see this. Uh, but yesterday they, they, they called a the handyman. Yeah, yeah. And then it was fixed, but I, he didn't remove it apparently, because you can still see it here. Yeah. I can call him and I can uh, just let you into your room. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't notice that it oh, yeah, all yeah, no, came no, out. That, that's, uh, yeah. that's not your problem. Otherwise, I would have removed it, but oh, I, no. did, I didn't yeah, realize. Yeah. It, it is our job. Okay. <laughs> so I will just call the, yeah. call the handyman. Yeah, okay. Maybe, maybe I can get it out myself also. I'll just try it first. Yeah, yeah you can see it uh, yeah. right there, yeah. yeah ah, you have a knife. It. Swiss Army knife, always good. Yeah. <laughs> can be a lifesaver. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, you got it. Ah! ah. <laughs> it's stuck up under. That's the problem. Yes. Oh, that's a small, Should we try? small piece. Yeah. We've just come, come outside. Yeah. If it works or not, I will come. Okay. Yeah, okay. No. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <Perfect>. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. Well, that was a coincidence. I think I'm gonna go to the diner. Diner. Yes. Um, this one, boss. When the food is ready. It'll beep. Yes. No, no, boss. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And you can pick the food up. Yeah. Yes. Okay. I was craving a pizza, <laughs> so I ordered a pizza, and when it's ready, then uh, this thing will bust. But to do something local, I got this Nordic cider, which is actually from here, from the Faroe Islands. How cool is that? And it has 4.7 percent alcohol. So, not so, so, but, uh, I never had a Nordic cider, so that's All visitors are kindly asked to leave the ship. The gangway will be closing in a few minutes. Oh, they're already closing the gangway, so we must be leaving soon. Hmm. Panic, panic, my buzzer goes. Ooh. And we excuse this delay in our departure. The reason for delay is we had some rough weather. Okay. Come from from Denmark to Faroe Islands. I really know. <laughs> we had rough weather. But we aim to we live in the to morning. arrive safely tomorrow morning on schedule, and that is half past eight local time. So it's half past nine shift time. But we can expect a delay of about half an hour time. Okay. And we are set the course up towards uh, Johannes, and then we will enter the islands right between the islands. So I hope you enjoy the view, and I wish you all a pleasant voyage. Thank you. Thank you. All right, that was it for today. I really hope you liked this video. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up and subscribe down below. And then in the next episode, I will arrive in Iceland. 